Avoid at all costs and didn't sleep for three nights. Just some of the titles of the reviews of the place that we will be staying tonight. Why, you might ask? Well, as van lifers, we feel as though it's now our duty to review these reviews to see if there's any truth behind them. Now, we're not taking Cozy this time, mainly because there's no security past 10 p.m. and a fight could break out at any point. Let's go. If I'm completely honest, I'm not exactly sure what to expect from this place. Is it going to be as bad as people say? Or are we going to have a great time and party with the, uh, yeah, the campers? Well, if I'm honest, I just hope we get some sleep if people are being loud. Now, what might shock you is this place is actually a two and a half stars out of five. And from the outside, that doesn't sound that bad. No, it doesn't. But when looking at the reviews, all of the good ones came from the water sports that's nearby. So like the kayaking and the sailing and everyone was saying how good it is. And when we delved in, especially this year, most of the reviews were one star. I think all of them. I don't think most. I think 2023, all of them are one star. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But at least we have our van to hide in because we can just like close the, the blinds and pretend that I don't know, we're somewhere oh, you, nice. Yeah, you can pretend you're in anywhere. So not only are we staying at a campsite, but this place also has a hotel that runs alongside it. So naturally we booked ourselves a room. One of the reviews that stuck out to me the most was um, was David. Oh God, what's David said? How is this described as a hotel? Staff are few and far between. No restaurant, bar or breakfast facilities. Vending machines only. I wonder if there's a bag of Skittles, I'd take that. And the smallest and dirtiest rooms imaginable. Avoid at all costs, it's abysmal. Travel Lodge is five stars compared to this hellhole. <laughs> Dirty, absolutely scruffy, changed rooms three times. Third room, sent a cleaner in while I was there. Ended up taking stuff off him to do it myself. Nowhere to get a drink. The the vending machine broke. I understand it's a cheap place. Wait, but the, th the vending machine broke? <sighs> It's the only place you can get food and it broke. I hope they fixed it. But the filth was on another level. Charlotte wasn't happy either. If we weren't so late, we'd be leaving. She claimed there was exposed wiring. The room was filthy and there was even black mold, which is ridiculous. Right, I'm not being funny, but I feel my eczema flaring up just talking about that. <laughs> <laughs> but we've got a campsite to do first before we even go there. Awful night camping, kids running around screaming. Um, there's multiple mentions of like people coming here to get drunk and fights and no security after 10 p.m. apparently, which is amazing. Toilets and shower blocks are utterly disgusting. There was cleaners, but they're not doing their job. Right. So there's a common theme that this place is quite dirty. So I guess we start at the toilet blocks. And... It's, it's a lot of repetitive. It's just like loud, feral children, drunk adults and dirty facilities. Ah. <laughs> Interesting. Just the spell a little bit. Don't mind me just coming for the poo check. Anybody in here? Just doing a poo check. <laughs> it's it's not that bad. I think I'll just wash my hands to be on the safe side. Uh -huh. Yeah. Right, well I'm not being funny, but these don't look too bad. Maybe slightly outdated but clean nevertheless. Showers look fine. Things look fine. No, I'm happy with that. I'm actually really happy. I mean, maybe they have improved or we've just come after, straight after they've cleaned. Maybe I don't know, but I would say this is not the worst I have ever been to ever. I mean, it's not <laughs> I found more. A bit bookier in here. It just does the job, doesn't it? Nothing wrong with that at all. Well, that's questionable. Um, is that, is that blood? Yeah, I think it might be. A wild, what's it? Ted stinks. I can neither confirm or deny that. Right, so, I, I'm happy with that. I don't think them reviews are so accurate because they were pretty clean. Maybe it's, it's out of season. Maybe. I'm happy. I am very pleasantly surprised with everything I've seen so far. Like, even down to the grass. Look at it, I've never seen, except for here where people have been parked, I've never seen such perfect grass. I'm ever so slightly disappointed because I, I, I don't know why I kind of wanted it to be really bad. But hopefully the hotel gives us something to work with. <laughs> Is that bad to say? Well, no, we want it to be interesting, right? <laughs> I don't want to come to a clean campsite. Who do you They're think so we are? It's so boring. Yeah. It's like, although that cubicle. Did you, do you want to see the cubicle? Did you, yours look like this? I don't know. 
Can I show you? Yeah. I've never seen anything like it. I think POA, we go to the hotel room, see what it's like, come back. Because like the worst reviews about here were like loud noise, feral children, drunk parents. Yeah, so it could still be fun to sleep <laughs> here, right? <laughs> Although, we've got neighbours and they've got a really, really long thing and they've pulled out a barbecue and it looks like they're going to have a great time. Maybe we can make friends with them and maybe they... Oh, he's got, he's got his bloody apron on! Oh my god, he's starting no, food now. Oh, wow! Maybe people love it so much that they want to gatekeep it so they leave really bad reviews. Oh, they're fakers. Fake reviews. Yeah. Yeah, that's possible. Go no away. unauthorised vehicles beyond this point. Right. Um, I am officially beyond the point, so <laughs> I think I might turn around because I am unauthorised. Yeah, but what is it with people and not putting actual signs? Like we're just supposed to know where things are. We're looking for the hotel. Are we going to be able to park here? Mm, yeah, because there's a van there. So just, park, just, just, yeah, just take up two spaces, who cares? I don't care, do you care? I, I don't think I do, I don't think I care, no. <laughs> places to go there's uh, quite a few good uh, good scenic places around here church rock cemetery is the oldest is uh, is the oldest and biggest graveyard in nottingham is oh, that it see? yeah that's it sweet your, your room is written on your key thank you very much lovely oh secure that is nice and secure that's always good <laughs> right to win lock. Oh, I see. <laughs> Ooh. Uh. I think our van's bigger than this. So there was three main points to the hotel which I thought stood out. Small rooms. Yeah. 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 Filthy and mouldy. Well, we've not checked the bathroom yet, so we can't make that Okay, that's, that's an assumption that could still be, okay. An exposed dangerous wiring. It's there, look. If you, if you move your leg in a, in a certain way, trying to get through here, look. If you've got a buckled knee, then you might, you might catch your foot in that. And that is dangerous way. Do you think? Yeah. You know what I think? If you can dream it, you can achieve it. Now, I've dreamt some weird stuff. Plasma? I nearly didn't see that, to be honest with you. That could have been an iPad. Well, get it on then. Is it got to be, is it? Um, I don't. I think I want to touch that. No. It's definitely not clean. Is it not? No, no. Is it actually not? No. Oh, why is it dusty? That's well, how you know I that can't they... imagine many people stay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. on me towel. <laughs> Tax them once. Oh, hot chocolate. I'll have a go on that. Oh. Oh, it's purple. I didn't know Stephen Mulhern was in The Simpsons. <laughs> <laughs> What's the bathroom saying? It's fine. Is it? I mean, wear and tear, but apart from that. I mean, other than, you know, a bit of scrapage here and there. Right, well, first of all... What's that? I'm not laying down. I was about to lay down. What's that? Ugh. Oh, there's a hair on my bed. Is there? Is it my hair, though? No. Oh, no, it's not. It's black. Ugh. I mean, even the views... <laughs> well, there's a car off there. These reviews aren't accurate. Maybe we just got blessed with good room and good pitch on the campsite. <laughs> I've had a stressful day. Have you? So, uh. Mine! This sandwich is. Sorry? Is it nice? I've been reviewing places, you know? That's oh, that... you're reviewing Morrison's now? No. Oh. I've had a stressful day reviewing. <laughs> the kids are very loud here. They scoot like really close to all the vans and <laughs> scream and. Finally, part of a review that's actually correct. But can you imagine if you were in a tent? Even louder. But it's not even that late yet, so... Oh yeah, well, it doesn't matter, kids are having fun. It is currently half past eight, which means we're locked in. Do you know what's funny though? If we were in a car, we'd be allowed to leave, but because There's we're a in a height van... It's the weirdest thing I've ever seen. There's a height restriction, so if you're in a van or something this tall, over six foot six or something... Yeah, you can't get in or out. You can't leave. So if, if someone came now and wanted to do anything to us, we wouldn't be able to drive out. Luckily, there was no reviews about, you know, murders or anything like that. I just want to say that this whole trip has been a lie and a shambles. Nothing's been how it said it was on the reviews, but that could be because we're out of season. When we want good, we get bad luck. 
when we want bad we get good luck it's the opposite for us it is maybe it'll be different at breakfast and maybe like the world will implode or something maybe i'll start cooking the bacon for breakfast and everything will just like kids will just start running out of their vans screaming and there's not a peep outside there isn't a sink go and listen go and open the door and listen silence I reckon we should go to sleep then, seeing as there's nothing else going on. Not even entertainment on. I know, where's the clubhouse, you know what I mean? Yeah. When I went camping as a kid, it was like arcades, clubhouse. Yeah. So we'll let you know if anything changes. Probably not though. I can get my socks off. Oh Both. God, you have to. Don't film it. I slept pretty well. I mean, overall... I would stay here again, I think. Would you? Yeah. I would say that the one that we went to in Cornwall was worse than this. I guess don't come in the peak of season. That must be it. Them reviews must just be from the peak of season. They must take on too many people at once. No noise in the night. Like, yeah, the children are a bit screamy, but, you know, you can see that they're just having fun. They went fun. to bed at, like, 10 or whatever. Yeah, they did go to bed at 10, didn't they? And they weren't making any noise. <laughs>